Welcome back to Crypto's Rich Boy. Today we're going to be talking about pool mythical or just mythical or just mythical pool. But anyway, like this video, subscribe to the channel, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below and share it with your friends. Guys, now I've been covering this since about Friday. It has been a really, really cool project. What caught my eye is <clears throat> I really, really enjoy collecting Pokemon cards. And this is something when I saw it, one, I thought the T-Rex riding the shark was super, super cool. And then I was like, it has to do with Pokemon. I knew this was a project that I could really, really, um, you know, have get behind right and um little disclaimer i am invested in this coin so that is uh so you know always do your own research not financial advice so let's go ahead and take a look at the price look at this guys um saw this on friday wrote it up uh, you know, just let you know, I haven't sold a single coin yet. Yeah, some people call me dumb. Some people call me a hodler. Some people call me a degen. Um, whatever the term is, I am, uh, I like the project, right? I like the project. I like the, um, I like the, the meme that, it, that it's about. I like the, the meaning behind it. You have to think when you pull that mythical, when you pull that rare card from that pack, it's a good feeling. So I was like, why not bring that into the crypto space? So this is really, really neat. Um, so this is what I see, guys. I see this is forming um, a big, big, like, falling wedge, which normally breaks to the upside. So let me go ahead and uh, do some TA. Let's do some TA. Let's see what we got. And, um, you know, a lot of you have been following me for a while. I haven't been doing videos. Got, I went on vacation, and then I started a new position. And uh, <clears throat> I think um, sometimes I never know where my meetings or when my meeting, uh, when I'm going to have meetings. But today, I uh, I was like, okay, I got a couple of minutes. So let me go ahead and do this. So. All right, guys, so it looks like we're going to have to start here, and let's see what we got. So some people could do it one of two ways. So some people, mm, no, I don't think that would work. So we could pretty much do it from here, right? <clears throat> so um, this is a falling wedge, and so we can either do it from the main candle line, which looks like... That is it right there. So if if we're doing it there, let's see, we gotta bring this right about here. It's so crazy. Like I don't think this has a market maker set up on it, but it's so crazy how charts always play out. Like it's the craziest thing. Like I don't think people try to do this. Maybe they do. Maybe they don't. But <clears throat> the chart will always. You can always find some type of pattern in the chart. And so, um, what we really need to do, guys, right now is we need to break this. And the RSI is looking like it's 52. 52 is uh, more buying than selling by a tad bit. So we need to break this, and we need to get back probably into the sevens, like six to sevens. Um, you know, we can do a couple things. We can trade sideways or we can just push our way up. Uh, you know, I'd rather just push our way up all time highs. Everybody becomes a gajillionaire and we all are chilling. We're all good. Uh, but so that is, uh, option one. Option two is we reject, we come back down. We hit this support, which looks like it's going to be, let me see. It's crazy. I have multiple screens. I use the same computer for my lives that I do for my record videos. I have multiple screens on this thing. So sometimes um, the, the mouse tries to go to, to the other screen. So, I mean, we have a pretty good floor right here around the threes, right? <clears throat> um, I would say. So two options. We could break through this. RSI is looking like we're more buying than selling by a tad bit. So it could be very possible. Or we can fall, hit this. Hit the threes again, come back up, and then break this. So um, I'd rather break it sooner. That way there's less to kind of have to push back up. 
um, that would be kind of my goal. And uh, I will be adding more later today. Um, so that is something that I tend to do, right? And um, to be honest, this kid went from a Friday night play to a weekend play. And um, now I just... I don't know. I'm kind of I'm liking the project, so I'm still filling it out <clears throat> for right now. I'm holding and um, I think this, you know, the dev, the, the team is really good. I, I was added to the, the team chat. They have like 20 people in there that are working pretty hard for what I see. So they had a great launch, great launch, you know, so they so they launched. They kind of fell. I got in. I got in right here at this candle right here. They kind of fell. And so right now I'm kind of kind of breaking even, right? So it's just kind of like uh, I just I'm I like the I like the meme, I like the the artwork, I like the the aspect of that mythical pool. <clears throat> That's pretty cool, and um, you know, kind of resonates with with my whole uh, Pokemon Pokemon Go journey. Um, I actually met my wife playing Pokemon Go, so it's pretty fun fact. So um, it is something that. Uh, you know, I was collecting Pokemon cards, I think, in 1999 when they first came out. I was like, I forgot, like, uh, in elementary school, I think. And I was collecting Pokemon cards, and I was super excited. I remember I got my first Charizard. So, uh, this kind of resonates with me just a little bit. So, it's uh, going to be a fun project. And, and like I said, the team is really, really uh, pushing hard. They did all the right things. They got the bots. They did the trending. They got the dex tools. They... They did all of that. Keeping up with socials, um, 184. Go ahead and uh, uh, follow them, guys. Follow them if you haven't already followed them. So they did all that. They did fatality. They did finders. They did decks. They did calls. And they did they did a ton of different things. So the community has been working and grinding hard. We won't give up till we hit the millions. We uh, invite our beloved calls to join us in establishing this project to millions for the community. So, uh, like I said, really, really cool artwork in the background. Look at that. The Charizard. I was like, let's go have Ash. <clears throat> and then, um, you know, have some really, really cool memes right there. Really, really cool people. Team is still cooking. So, the team is still cooking, guys. Oh, man. What in the world? I am slacking. I always seem to slack when we go ahead and repost team is still cooking look at that um they reposted my um my post and so i mean at the end of the day it's a newer project right they've been they've been raiding um the charts looking pretty good the chart what it's about to break the so let's oh that's crazy baby all right so got 410 holders so for a project that's a couple days old, that is actually pretty good. Um, <clears throat> about to break the 50,000 market cap. I know there was somebody that said uh, once they break the 50,000 market cap, they were going to put some more, I think, into um, promoting. I think it was uh, buying lightning bolts. Uh, I forgot exactly what it was, but I know somebody, they, uh, they burned some coins already earlier, and they were going to... Uh, put some more towards marketing. So that's really cool. Liquidity is 23.9K. Market cap is 49.47K. Circulating supply is 991.17 million. That's because, um, so wow, they really did. They, they burnt the 8 million. That's cool. And um, so 24 hour volume is 117,000, almost 118,000. And uh, it checks out. The audit checks out. So <clears throat> it is, uh, so let's take a look at audit. So contract verified, not a honeypot. Uh, there's no buyer sell tax, not mintable, not tax mod modifiable. So uh, guys, let's push. Look at that, man. I'm loving, look at that. That looks so, I don't know. Sometimes I like to just zoom out and see that huge green candle. It looks absolutely amazing. Guys, so I've been seeing projects go from this uh, this point to the multi millions. I literally just seen a project go from two hundred thousand dollars a couple of days ago to over three million dollars. That was a fifteen x. That's one thousand dollars to fifteen thousand dollars. This is less. I got my previous projects at more. I got into Pepe at a hundred million. I got into Perpe at five hundred thousand. This is five. Uh, this is ten percent of where I got into um some other projects 
and way lower percentage than when I got in uh, <clears throat> other projects like Pepe. So this has a lot of room to grow, a lot of potential. And um, I got a group, 15,000 people on Facebook. And uh, who knows if, oh, hold on, give me a second. Oh, hold on. All right. So who knows if, um, if we get, if we get there, I might dedicate the group to, um, I might dedicate it to, um, to mythical. We'll see. So, you know, but we'll have to get up to like half a million <clears throat> to a million dollar, um, to a million dollars. And, uh, I think I wouldn't mind, I wouldn't mind dedicating it. Uh, it has a lot of things that I really like. So pretty cool, pretty good stuff. Um, and then I, I'm going to do some lives. I'm thinking about doing some lives multiple times a week. Uh, let's see how the chart looks. If we can break it, I probably will. I did a, I did a live, what, Friday? And uh, we broke fives, baby. Let's go live. Um, you know, let's see. We really, really need to break um, kind of into the sixes and uh, into the sevens. So once we break into the sevens, <clears throat> we will be looking... Uh, like an official reversal is happening, which is very, very bullish. So, guys, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Um, like, like this video, subscribe to the channel. Until next time, guys.